fact, until this was done, until he did iRay VR, I had never been inside my building before. Now this building is designed to be energy efficient. And so all the windows that you see in the ceiling is intended to let light in. But just enough light, and the light and the angles of those triangles are designed so that during different times of the year, the light doesn't come into the building and heat up the interiors of the building because making it uncomfortable. And so we're trying to use as much natural lighting as possible. And so the, the rendering of this building and making sure that it's comfortable, well lit, and uses as little energy as possible is really important. Look at this. The polished concrete. I have never been in our building before. <laughs> All of this is in real time. And it's in 3D. And the lighting is so beautiful. I think I'm going to go ahead and finish this building. <laughs> 500,000 square feet. It's going to house somewhere between two to 3,000 million employees. This is our phase one. And that is a building inside a building. It's the heart of the building. You come in through the center of that heart. You park underneath this building. We put all the cars underground. Because, you know, here, here in Silicon Valley, um, our, our uh, weather is really fantastic. And so no sense, no sense of reserving all that wonderful climate just for, just for cars. So we put all the cars on the ground, and eventually, one of these days, all the cars will park by themselves. And so you'll just get out, and your car meanders down this ramp and finds a parking space and uh, you know, future building. Okay? I ready VR, you guys. This is really incredible. Come to my phone. Well, not too many people have supercomputers, though.